just a little pinch and she broke off real real easy real quick what's up you guys just see your girl jasmine here back with another video and today i have some wing stock and i'm so hungry so i just really want to just dive right in i have some um i have all flats by the way what part of the chicken do you do you like do you like flats or do you like jumps I got all flats, I got Cajun, and then I have some french fries and some ranch and some Sprite, and then I have a little brownie. I never tried it before, but we're gonna try it today. So without further ado, let's get into this video. I'm so hungry, and I think, wait. I ordered more stuff, but they never sent it to me. So after this, I gotta call them and get my money back or get something. Cause I ordered way more than this. Mmm. Mmm. Their ranch is good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm I'm so hungry. Um oh. I should take a thumbnail. Yeah, I love flats. They're literally the best part. Mm-hmm. Wingstop literally has the best chicken. Oh, it's so good. I don't know what they put on the fries, but it's like a little sweet. That is different. Like it's salty and sweet. That is so good. I've been wanting wing stock for so long now. It's like I've been craving it.
hate when you get soda and it's flat. Like, excuse me. I barely even drink soda. And if I do get soda, don't give me flat soda. That defeats the purpose. I'll just drink my water. Or if I get a drink from a restaurant or something, give me some lemonade or some tea. But they didn't have no lemonade. This ranch is really good. Mm-hmm. Like, mm-hmm. Honestly, mm. I'm sorry, I'm just so hungry. Honestly, the worst thing about this government shutdown is the fact that it was partial government shutdown. Is the fact that I can't eat all the foods I like. Or, not that I can't, but I should be cautious about the foods. You know, I can't eat fresh vegetables. I can't go and get none. Because I don't want to get sick. I'm so hungry. I don't even know what to talk about. I'm just hungry. I mean, the other day I was watching Breakfast Club with Little Mo and her husband. And I guess Little Mo just the Queen Naja situation. I think that's a prime example of it's not what you say but how you say it mm. because I honestly think at first 
what Little Mo said about Queen Naja, about how... I don't think it was that bad. But after watching The Breakfast Club, it made sense. It, it sounded more personal, if that makes sense. Because every... It's like, if you're trying to be an artist, you shouldn't... I don't think you should feel a type of way about what everybody has to say. There are, you have literally millions of critics. Because that's the lifestyle you want. You wanted millions of critics, and now you have them. And then, I don't know. I think you need tough skin to be in that type of environment. I guess I got that. Lil Mo is basically trying to say it's, it's because you're pregnant that you can't sing to your fullest extent. And I understand that. I mean, Beyonce was like, it's pretty hard to sing when she was pregnant. Okay. But she ain't no Beyonce. Not yet, at least. I don't know, but. But when. Mm. But when Lil Mo said that. Her uncle was a pastor that had the same melody as Queen Song. It makes so much sense. Like, this is clearly personal. Okay, you talk crap about the uncle. Denise talk crap about you. The boyfriend different him. The husband different you. There's just a lot. I don't know if all of this is just for social media or if they're serious, but I don't think it was ever that serious to be like, yo, he need to catch a fade. He need to catch a fade. Like, mm, those is fighting words. And why did it ever get that serious? Not that serious. To start fighting. Ooh. I mean, but I get it. Clarence was different than his girl. His girl, who he know, is not confrontational. You know, she doesn't fight. Or she's not with that life. I get it. It definitely was entertaining, though. That's for sure. Shout out to Meek Mill. Making real progress in the prison reform changes. That's what I like to see. Because it's like... Excuse me. 
Excuse me. It's like, that's what we need to see. Like, he chose not to let his past define him. He chose to move forward in a different way. And now he's seeing more success because of it. And having allies and friends like Jay-Z only just boosted him up to the next level. It's like, okay, you get this friend. He introduced you to this guy, introduced you to this, 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 this person. These people got the real money. And this is how you get things started and happening and moving forward. And I applaud him. Oh no, I'm running out of ranch. Mm. Mm. This is so good. It has a little kick, but it's not too saucy. That's why I don't drink soda. That's the burn. Yeah. Yeah. Comment down below. What is some good shows on Netflix to watch, some good movies, shows, whatever. Because I need something to watch on Netflix when I'm doing like like mundane tasks. And I feel like I've seen everything. Comment down below, put some good shows in the comments. I want to make my own ranch dressing. How do you make ranch though? Woo, this is my last one, y'all. I'm getting full. Okay, so before I go, I'm gonna just try this on camera. What does that say? Uh uh. Um, triple chocolate chunk brownie. 
gonna just try a piece on camera just to see if it's good, just to see if it's worth it. Even though I'm already full. Oh, ooh. Mm. ooh. Okay, she's moist. Okay, just a little pinch and she broke off real real easy, real quick. Mm. Yeah, it smells like triple chocolate. Mm. Okay, y'all ready? Y'all ready? She's rich. She's rich. Mm. Mm. Can't eat a lot of her at one time. But she's rich. She's chocolatey. Got the chunks. She's moist. But she don't get stuck to the roof of your mouth. And like in crevices in your mouth which is good because nothing's worse than like a fudge chocolatey brownie and it just gets stuck everywhere and you can't eat it unless you have something to drink you can eat her without something to drink you might want some but she's still edible without a little bev but yeah this is all for this mukbang. I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for my next video tomorrow. And until next time, stay awesome.